I always love people saying this. You think we receive a script, do you? We're talking Jennifer here. You get a few ideas bumbled together and then the script evolves. Well, there were lots of cast members I was very excited to work with. I think, I think John Hamm and Rebel Wilson probably take the ticket there. And um, they both didn't disappoint. If I think of a funny memory from the film, Oh, look. Um, one of the funniest memories was actually putting Kate Moss in the Thames to come out with a champagne glass in one hand and a cigarette in the other. And I felt we were on the right track. <laughs> I always felt the biggest challenge was the expectation. From the word go, as soon as people knew we were making this film, the excitement started to build and it was managing the expectation. But honestly, they really needed a bigger canvas from tele television and, and to be honest, I think they did really well. Um, the scene that I loved more than anything was the day we were at the Vauxhall Tavern with 60 drag artists. It was an out-of-body experience. I'd never seen anything like it. And also we started filming at eight and some of them have been up since four in the morning to get ready for us. And they were with me the whole way. No one got tired, no one got crotchety and we had a most glorious day. Sadly, I think Eddie. I really do. I do feel that we're all a bit like Eddie. We all get it slightly wrong. It's not that, you know, you're always making that trip, that fall, that mess up. Um, she does it rather brilliantly, but that's who I feel. Oh, well, I sort of think we did it in the film with the advert, isn't it? It's perfect because that's the life they want, is they want that glamorous life and Coke is glamorous and they're glamorous. Well, I've just seen one for the first time. Isn't that gorgeous? I mean, it's so cool. We love it. <laughs>